In the previous video, I was splitting this three pack of soap with my wife. She cut it right down the middle, so we each got half of all three bars, or we got three halves, or we got three halves each bars, of, or each of us got three halves bars of soap. Now, just to make sure that we really understand what three halves is, and remember, three halves is really the same thing as three divided by two. If someone says three divided by two, you could say, hey, I'm going to represent that as three halves. Or if someone says three halves, they could, you could say, well, that's the same thing as three divided by two. Three divided, three divided by two. But just to really understand this number, let's actually think about where we would plot it on a number line as well. So let me draw a number line here. I'm going to start. That is zero. Let me draw a line. So as straight of a line as I am capable of drawing. And let's say that this right over here represents one. So that would be one bar of soap in this example. And let's say that this right over here is half a bar. This is half a bar. And let's say that this is at one and a half, one and a half bars. And let's say that this right over here is two bars of soap. So we have three halves. So let's think about this. Remember, three is just three, three halves is three times one half. Or since we already split this into halves, we just have to go three of these halves. So let's do that. So this is one half. This is one half. Now we're going to have two halves. Two halves. That takes us to one. And we know that because two halves is equal to one. And now let's do our third half. Our third half is right over here. And so that is three halves. And we see three halves is the exact same thing as one and a half. And just to hit that point home, we already saw that three, divided, three halves is the same thing as three divided by two. If you were to divide three by two, you would get, you would get, well, two goes into three exactly one time, one time. And then what would you have left over? Well, you would have one half left over you would have one half left over. So three halves is the same thing as one and a half, which is exactly what we saw here. You could view this as we have one and a half bars of soap. And this is where you would plot it on the number line. Three halves is halfway in between one and two.